Hi, Caleb with Brownhouse here. And in today's quick tip, we're gonna talk about choosing bolts for your 1022 build. All right, so if you've been looking at bolts on the Brownells website, you'll notice that the Brownells bolt comes in three different flavors, all right? And you may have questions as to what the main differences are. Um, I'll start with just this stainless one here, and I'll say underneath the finish, all three of these are exactly like this one. They're 17-4 stainless steel machined out of billet and then heat treated. Uh, they come fully assembled, so extractor, firing pin, everything you need ready to drop into your gun. Uh, you don't have to do any additional installation on any parts or anything like that. So they come ready to go. The only difference is indeed the finishes. So let's talk about maybe some of the benefits of those finishes. And I will say that you know this is the base stainless one here. That is a very good option and it is the most affordable option. So as you go up in the finishes, the prices get a little bit, uh, they increase a little bit. All right, so let's talk about the black nitrided one. So underneath it, it is just that 17-4 stainless, but this is black nitrided. That black nitride coating is a really hard coating, and it's also gonna be a little bit easier to clean because it's a slicker surface on there. Then we move up to the titanium nitride. This is one of my favorites. It's still really easy to clean. The titanium nitride is a really hard coating as well, uh, but you get that extra gold Gucci aspect to it, and that's really the only difference. It is a little bit more expensive than the black nitride, so you kind of have to you know, base your pros and cons, see if it's right for you. But all three of these is an excellent choice for your 1022. Uh, if you notice in mine here, I do have the standard black nitride one, um, but I'm probably going to switch it out to that titanium nitride at some point. All right, uh, that's all there is to it. If you have any questions or comments about these and you're watching this on YouTube, feel free to post them down below. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button and that notification bell so you get notified whenever we air future videos. And if you're watching this on the website, feel free to give us a call on the tech line. We'll be happy to help you out. Thanks for joining us and we'll see you next time.